Meet me. Welcome back to another Squirrely Guild Wars. Um, we are up against Artemis, and we actually versed them not too long ago, right here. And look how close this match was. We had the exact same Havoc, but we ended up winning because we had more towers. Now, I've been filtering out the DC fights. I think this time I'm going to show them because we are rank 25. And I don't know if I'll have an opportunity to record Guild Wars at this high of a level in the future. So, as always, the squirrel only takes on the toughest opponents. Let's see what we have here. So I think these teams are okay, except the bottom one. I'm going to swap out for the pigeon. I think the rest of it is good. So let's go ahead and take down one of these top 25 forts. Okay, so we get pigeoned here. Dark blade. Ow. I'm sure fortune will be on um, our side today as well. Hmm. We just work on the Rylet. Shall I have a go? Get him a little lower. I don't know what his HP is. I might be able to just force him soon. This world. He has ten thousand HP. Has no place for you. This world's existence. Oh, he's on life steal though. Okay. Fortune will favor us. And heal up Ruel here. Now isn't the time to hesitate. Oh, I believe. This may be enough. If I hit him, it's definitely enough. That Falconer Clurry is on JFA. So no Aureus. Okay, so Ryleth does go down. Perfect. I'm sure Fortune will be on our side. Um, let's just keep healing up this prowl. If you're ready, let's go. I do have he sees S3 here, so I think we take this flurry out. The PC matches are really not all that slow. This is actually a pretty fast win. Fortune will favor us. I think I'll just heal up the crowd here. I swear. Because we're about to get defense buff up. Isn't the time to yep. Let's push him back. If you wish to and provoke him. Defense buff means that the Arbiter does nothing. Take him out. Descends his bleed on me. Shall I have a go? And then we finish him off. Will favor us. Um, we'll just attack. There's no reason to bother. This world and no this Arbiter is dead, Beto. We move on to round two against Pocky Senpai. Okay. Got it, we will soul burn here into this well to make sure she dies. Shall we bring this to a close? Well, our crowd goes and pummels us a little bit. Big damage. We'll get this attack buff up. Death is your repentance. Don't come near me. Now we dunk this Ruel. Well drops dead. As Tene goes. I will step on you. Anti crit does work. We've got a barrier. Fight a little harder, we'll Start pigeoning this crowd. You want to try me? Get some big damage into S Tene. Maybe I'm working too. Pigeon goes again. 
I believe this is what the goddess feels. Let's see. Nice S10 A doesn't get hit. So the next um, S10 A attack, I'm thinking they go down. You aren't even fit to kiss Boom, let's blow them up. We do. Fight a little harder, Pigeon poke. I will guide you through the light. Um, LR Kraus still doesn't have his S3, so we'll just regular attack here. Got it. And Pigeon Poke. And there we go. The first fort goes down. Let's move on to the second fort. Alright, so fort number two. Looks like this first defense is really scary. DC Kraus and Ruel would crush this top one, but I think I need it for the bottom one, unfortunately. So we're going to try something top. We're going to try S10A, FCC, and DN instead. Let's advance together. Okay. So, we do go first. Let's put up a pack buff. Be punished. My FCC is faster than that Charles, so let's just do this. To block the Charles damage, it's a fast Charles, like a 200 plus Charles. Okay, we blocked all of that. Let's work on the Charles first. You get the stun. No Alexis, but he does have attack buff. Okay, did get unbuffable. I think what I'm gonna do is work on this Charles first. This is only a temporary alliance. I will guide you through the Um. Get this off. And then I'm going to try to drop the unbuffable off my s 10 by burning, so that my Yen can give her barrier again. Charles does go down. Ow. Okay, perfect. We will do this. Are you prepared for this? He CERN still has one more turn. You aren't even fit to kiss We can do this, get some big damage onto the FCC. And I think we'll be okay now. I believe this All right. is the goddess my goddess. Grant me the Maybe we could even push the T CERN back a little bit. Shall we go? Ooh, dual attack. Nice. Um, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna finish this T Surin right now. We pack her once, triggers the stealth. And now we throw the ball into her. We do manage to crack this first defense finally. So that should give the guild some confidence. Now we have Your this um, standard annoying defense. Crowl, DC Rylet, or it would be FCC um, Rylet Ruel. I can't talk. Sometimes I say things and I realize what I said made no sense. I guess I'm uh, just a nervous Nelly. Go on this Crowl. If you wish to fight me, um, I'll try to provoke the Ryolid. Nope. I'm charging. How much HP on this Rua? Only 19k. Fortune will favor us. Let's get this Crow low enough where Ruel heals her. That's my goal here. I'll probably never be able to provoke this Crow, so it's gonna be an annoying quest to try to get him stacks. Let's 
go. Don't worry. These dual attacks. I'm sure Fortune will be on our side. It's gonna revive her. Spirits of the five seasons. Lend me your strength. That means they're gonna switch to crowd. It's not a big deal. Shall I have a go? My DC is four. It's left. If you wish to fight, determination will be required. All right, my Krau's taking some damage. That is fine. Nice. We well hit the DC. Fortune will favor us. Um. Yeah, no need to heal anything here. This world's existence no longer. All right, now we can finish off this Ruel. Prepare yourself. I'm sure Fortune will be we'll just keep attacking. Shall I have a go? We'll attack into the Ruel real quick. Get a little bit of damage on her for DC, just in case. Heals the Krau, perfect. Now we dunk or not the Ruel. He's definitely dead here. Low HP Ruel. Ruel explodes. The Ryla has about 10k HP. Fortune will favor us. Um just do this. How many turns till Ryla has his SP? Oh he has it now. But I do have defense buff. Okay, so here comes the Ryalit dunk. Your life. But he's on MLDB, he's no violets, so no huge damage. I'm sure Fortune will be on our side today as well. Um. Hmm. Do I regular heal? I'll regular regular heal. That makes the Krau switch to my Krau. We're gonna take this slow and steady. I don't want to lose anyone this match. Fortune will favor us. Um, yeah, we'll just heal up and prowl. If you're ready, let's go. Let's do this. I want to motivate this crowd to S3. Is that enough? Yeah, it is. My crow is fine. If you wish to fight, we'll do this. Determination will be required. I'm sure fortune will be on our side today as well. Um. Actually, I'm just gonna heal up Ruel. Don't give up. Just in case. Be saved. Although I should 100% kill this uh, Ryalit here. Ryalit should die. And now we just have to finish off this little prowl. This world's existence no and DC's taking forever to get his thing up. Will favor us. Grant we'll me heal strength. my prowl. But we are playing it super safe. We don't want to lose anyone. To this is top 30 guild wars right here. Alright, so here we go. They horse into my prowl. My prowl should be fine. Yep, my Krau is fine, so we managed to not lose a single person. And we drop the mid fort. So we're 2 0 for now. Motivating the guild. And let's move on to the third and final fort. Alright, so third and final fort. We have a Charles T. Stern FCC again, and LR Krau Arbiter K. Ron. Looks like my guild's doing okay against this one. Um, the top one we're going to DC, and the bottom one I'm going to try this wonky comp. Valencia to beat the K-Ron, FCC to give me some bulk, and Arbiter is my main damage dealer. See how this works out. So fast-ish T-Surin. I'm silencing my Krow, it's unfortunate. I'll just attack into this. If this Charles is on counter set, I can 
eight DC stacks with him. Nice, nice. Fortune will favor us. Um, I don't know if I have to heal anyone, but I'll heal you well, just in case. I think my DC has S3 already. I'm sure Fortune will be on our side today as well. Does. Let's just get the skill Nelly off. Now isn't the time to hesitate. Um, I'm just gonna horse the Charles. The reason I'm doing this is so that I can kill him with DC without the soul burn. Cause he's gonna get a thick FCC barrier. Now we'll go into him. Should kill him even without soul burn. Yep. I want to cut this damage very quickly. If you're ready, let's go. Now we'll work on the FCC. Fortune will favor us. Um, let's just make everyone happy and healthy. So I'm going to heal up. Prow. You, know, you don't want to hold cooldowns too long, guys. Sometimes people make the mistake of saving their cooldowns. Um, because they want to use it at an opportune moment, but then what ends up happening is you just don't use the ability for like five turns. And then you could have had it back by then, but you don't. So you want to be kind of efficient about using your cooldowns. Because now my Ruel will just get all of her stuff back anyway. You see he almost has the soul burn already. Little ghoul attack heal. Isurin's gonna give DC that final stack. See, against any defense with a light unit, trust me, DC is not slow. It'll be faster than most other offenses. Okay. Now let's burn into this sucker. FCC's very tanky. Very, very tanky. Probably gonna survive. But we get some good damage into her. Eventually, my Prowl will have his horse back. Um, this t Cern is not a lifesteal t Cern, so let's just hit her. Push her back a little bit. Alexa's... Ouch. My past, regrets, and hesitation. I'll sever everything with me. What's the uh, crowd situation here? I have horse already, so instead of healing, I'm gonna do this. If you're ready, let's And I'm just going to wipe this FCC out. This should take her down, she's quite low. CC does go down. Isurin is just glued to the fat boy. No problem. We'll soul burn this. Now isn't the time to hesitate. Just slap this. Another Alexis. But no life steal. And we'll finish her off. There we go, so first fight is a success. Now let's check out the second one with my DPS strategy. I'll be your opponent. Um, wow, my Arbiter goes first. Try and blind his Arbiter. Oh, that's bad, we give him the pack buff. We'll get defense buff up before them, actually. They're pretty slow. That didn't do a whole lot. Now we get up skill Nullifier. And we'll step on them. I think I hit the K-Ron. Did I? No, I didn't. I didn't. Well, we stripped the attack buff, at least. 
Aaron goes on Alencia. Unfortunately, I didn't proc the immortality, so he's gonna do this again. But it is what it is. Um, I think I'm gonna wanna work on this thing. Kill the Arbiter. No Alexas, though. Okay. I think we're okay here. Um. Freaking MLDB is it very annoying. I'm gonna trigger the uh, S3 from Kron here. Probably gonna kill Alencia. That's okay. All that's left okay. is ruin. That is not okay. Insignificant. Um, all right, let's do this. Hit the arbiter. Okay, we're fine now. I'll be your opponent. Okay. So we lost someone here, but this K Ron should not one shot my FCC. Alright. So Fort Tor is complete. Top 25, 3 0. Squirrel is leading the way. Um, feels good to know that we can compete at high level Guild Wars. So as of right now, we're up around 2,000 Havoc. Um, but they do have a lot more tokens, and as you could see last time, this was a very, 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 very close match. We literally could not have been closer. So we're going to see what happens here. I'm going to type up some fort notes for my guild. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed these matches, and again, I promise next season I'll use a lot less DC. But it's not time to fool around, guys. I'm really trying to push this guild as high as we can go. Um, I've been very happy with our progress, considering that half the guild is real life friends and uh have a nice day peace out boys